Anchoring the news with someone is a lot like being married. That is very true. You spend hours in close, close proximity with little chance of having sex. You have no <laughs> idea that this is the stuff he's going to be reading, by the way. <laughs> and <Sorry>. reading <laughs> and smelling. And that's disgusting. All right, well, this takes patience. As you know, you have to learn another person's personality. <laughs> Their likes, their dislikes, their sense of humor, their strengths oh, and weaknesses. I like it rough. Go ahead now. And you have to do it all on live television. Well, over the past 32 months, this guy right here has had 16 of me, 16 co-anchors and substitutes. I'm into next the group thing. And despite having had worked with him and all of his shenanigans, some of them still wanted to offer their good wishes. Congratulations, Rob. I am so excited for you, and I have to say, I'm just thrilled that I got to be your 14th, no, we did the math, 15th, 15th female co-anchor over the years on World News Now America This Morning. Um, the first time I met you on set, out of all the co-anchors I've worked with in my career, you were the only person who made me feel like on day one that we had been friends forever. Your kindness, warmth, really comes across on camera, and you're ridiculously funny, and you know it. I am never going to forget our Christmas together last year. We got to share eggnog, wore some really hideous Christmas sweaters, and even had Santa visit. It's a memory I'm gonna keep close with me. I'm so excited for you, and I hope now this means that you finally get some sleep, my friend. Congratulations. Rob Nelson, congratulations. I really enjoyed the bro show that we did that one time. Remember the meteorite that came crashing down on the set? You're going to be great uh, in the next phase, the correspondent phase. I'm sure you're going to be a huge hit. Poor son of a gun who has to fill your shoes. That's a tough act to follow. You know what I'm saying? All the best, Rob. Aloha from Hawaii. Very, very big congratulations to Rob to now join the world of the living in the daytime. I'm one of the many women lucky enough to sit next to Rob Nelson at that desk, but I bet I'm one of the few who actually got to dance with him. That's my favorite memory of anchoring with Rob, dancing on the anniversary of disco at that desk. Very big congratulations to him. And Rob, hey, come take a vacation here in Hawaii. We'd love to see you. Congratulations. Take care. Rob, you've been so incredibly gracious and generous to every single one of us who have sat next to you in that co-chair. I want to thank you, and I know that generosity is going to shine through in your new gig. I am sending you the breaking news reporter's welcome basket, which will include the things that I have forgotten over the years. Uh, an iPhone charger, uh, hand warmers, and also the 100 calorie nut pack for when you are starving and can't stop to get a bite to eat. Congratulations and can't wait to see you dayside. Rob, my friend, congratulations on your move to the daytime. What can I say, it was super fun. I guess a highlight for me would have to be the NFL picks that I won, do you remember that? Uh-huh, yes, I know you do. Anyway, looking forward to seeing you in the sunshine. Hey Rob, it's your former co-anchor Peggy Bunker here, sending you farewell wishes as you finally get off the overnights. Although when I think back to our time together on the overnights, I think, you know, there's no other man I'd rather be up all night with. That did not come out right. Rob, remember that one time? It was like 3 a.m., like the middle of the night. And wait. You know, Rob, I was one of your first female co-anchors. And uh, since then, you've had a lot. Is Jenny going to see this? Rob, what I'm trying to say is that you're awesome, you're hysterical, and you will certainly be missed on the overnights. Sending you hugs and kisses. Mwah. Oh, hey, caught me, Rob, sorry. I gotta admit, I come into your office, I miss you. I like to try on your hat and your necklaces. Thirsty, in fact, I think this is actually mine. I left this in your fridge. But I'm so excited for you to come to Dayside. I've already been told your first three assignments are going to be Kate Middleton, Kim Kardashian, and Dog Rescues Cat from the Drain. I know totally up your alley. Just to get you read in on everything you're gonna be doing um, during Dayside, I bought you your favorite rag mag. You have a year subscription to this, so you can thank me later for that. But really excited for you, really excited for you to clean this mess of a desk. I don't know how many trees you killed, but this is actually kind of beautiful. It looks like an, a nice art project, but clean your desk up, please. Please get rid of these rotting oranges that have been in your office for God knows how long, probably since last Christmas. And can't wait to see you in the day side, but uh, before I go, okay. and the drink. Love you. See you soon.
Oh, wow. Well, let me say this. A 16, which is a crazy number, but I've been lucky to work with some incredibly talented, funny, smart, sexy, engaging, cool people, including Diana, my pre present company here. So I wish you all the luck in the world in the next chapter. I can't wait. But there was there was someone missing. Uh-oh. Uh who, who was missing? She's here now. Come on out. Who? Uh-oh. We have a surprise. Ah! You a little bearing should, gifts, a little scotch. Now I think I think you're ready. For I'm that. ready. I'm ready. Wow. To, uh, and blue leaves. She got the expensive wow. stuff. Of course. Woo! I and thank you, babe. Oh, I've heard about these. And yep. our favorite. My, our favorite gum, a little ice cube gum. Let me tell you. Let, let me tell you. After I drink this uh, bottle today, I'm gonna need this gum <laughs> to hide it from the uh, from uh, the bosses here. But. The, <laughs> This has been fantastic too, and uh, all these great folks here. I can't say enough about the incredible folks I've had a chance to work with. But like I've said before, I'm the Will Chamberlain of the Overnight Show, <laughs> and I'm leaving the set to go to the free clinic. Stay tuned, everybody. We'll be back. It's been fun. <laughs>